Welcome back, everyone, to the Banjo Tooie playthrough. And join me as we continue exploring the city of Atlantis. Oh. Oh, boy. I know I'm going to say that really exciting every time I have to say it. It's definitely something that needs to be emphasized. So this is a wonderful rendition of Atlantis. Um, quite a, quite thorough. For this game, at least. Well, this game is pretty thorough in general. So, looks like we... We don't know where we're going, but... That's alright. And we're heading back into the main area. I hope, truly hope, that we have a place to go. If not, I went through time skips, and that's kind of annoying. Okay, here's an open door. Electric Eel's Lair. Oh yes, this is where the move is. The new move. Somewhere around here. There we are. It's pretty much all that's in here is this. A uh, move. How exciting. Sea launches bird. Just watch her go through the water like a torpedo. Control stick to steer and A for speed. B to cancel if it's banjo you need. That didn't rhyme. That'll be all. Did they do it again? Oh, fine. I believe it's one more time that he will do that. He will miss. Oh man, the eels got me. Figures, anyway. Who knows why they did that? Putting those eels in there was just an annoyance. You know what else is annoying? Those big puffer fish. Hate them with a the passion. Alright, so Kukutsui can now do this, and this is how we get inside these fish with goodies. It's actually quite nice. Um, it has multiple uses, and one's right here. Show it off. Hold A and run into it. Absolutely just works. And this has granted us access to the ancient swimming baths. Which also doesn't have anything in it. Except... Where is it? I know it's here somewhere. I mean, it has absolutely nothing in it. There's a... Oh, yeah. Yeah. I need a split pad for... That. You think that's a Jinjo? You are wrong. Oh, he just facepalmed me, man. Absolutely owned me. Owned me. Yeah. Anyway, the only useful thing in here is, uh... We were staring right at it. I'm waiting for the camera to go back around. Hopefully. Hello. <laughs> what is going on here? Why does this guy matter? Oh, it just froze him. That was pretty cool. Oh, that worked out. Yes, there's nothing in here. Still not getting over that fact. Anyway, there is a Cheeto page up above the entrance right here. There we go. There it is. 
Cheeto. And there's no possible way we can get that, but oh, I will have to attempt it, just to make sure. We cannot get it right now. It's going to lead to frustration and death. Nothing we can do about it. Come on. Nothing. Nothing we can do. Alright. Back out to Atlantis. Um, we've got this door over we were just looking at that has a code. Could do that, but I'm just waiting to see what I'm going to do. Here we go. So, it's a little structure backwards. Uh, sideways M, horseshoe, sideways M, triangle, triangle. And I figure those aren't accurate representations of it, but... What we need to do is, is go input this code right behind us with eggs. And there's a very fun little minigame in there. So we need to figure out what these little statues... Mermaid statues? Uh, which ones are which? Very important. There's the first one. I believe it made a noise. That one's... yes. There we go. Huh, I took a chance there. Can't really hear the little noise it makes when you get it right. And over here... is that, that... And what do you know? The door opens. So, let's see what's in there. I don't... Yeah, no, it's not a very fun minigame. It's just a minigame. Nothing special, bad, or good about it. A lot of grenade things. Oh. We nice to have some grenade. Oh, you gotta be kidding. Though so I did get ten, so that's good. Dude, where are you going? I'm sure I knew what was in that door already, so I'm kinda like, I don't wanna go in there. But it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen as soon as you can snap your fingers. So, Temple of the Fishes. You're fishy, fishy. I'm a gold fish. Oh, it's in Mario. Oh boy, what was the name of that game? Mario's a game of gallery. Crispy Bacon. What are you doing, Mr. Bacon? I'm on vacation trying to photograph those lovely paintings on the wall down there. Sounds fascinating. Oh, it is, but those awful fish keep attacking me. Why not get a spare gun? This camera was too expensive, I had no doubloons left. Perhaps you could protect me while I'm down there. 
instead. Oink, oink. <laughs> sure. Right then. If you could just follow me down to the bottom. Oink, oink, piggy, piggy. Now, I hope this didn't take multiple tries, otherwise I would be cutting this out. But I hope not. Oh, it doesn't look like it. I'm sure I got this on the first try. How do these fire eggs work underwater again? Uh. Hello. This seems to be a decent angle to get everything from. So they keep coming from that direction. That's wonderful. Hello, fishies. Oh. That's stopping up the difficulty. To two fishes. It's really hard. It is not. It's not for the kind hearted here. Killing fishes with fire underwater. Quite hard to look at. Oh! Oh, pretty good. I think that will do it. I'm off back to the surface. Oink, oink. <sighs> I got all the shots I needed. Perhaps this thing I found earlier may interest you. It's just a thing he found earlier. <laughs> They don't even claim it to be gold or anything. Oh, I'll have to get these pictures printed. Bye. Oink. Okay. Oh, I'll take your jiggy. I will. Uh, that's pretty much all that's in here. We've been in this place. I think it might be time to go over to the boss. Davy Jones locker. That sounds like a good idea to me. I think it's this way. I don't remember. Easy enough to get lost in this world. Oh, this is definitely not Davy Jones locker. But it is a new area nonetheless. Oh goodness, this global is gonna be the death of me. Oh, okay. Not too bad, but let's guess Wumba's wigwam is up here. Wonderful! I was hoping to run on this because I think it's clear that we need to go fight this boss as this transformation. Makes things much easier. Oh wait, that isn't going to do anything. Yeah, global. Want to go to Humba? Sure. Magic ready. Jump in Wumba Pool. Dive in Wumba Pool. Dive into the action. Look at this, a submarine. What would call this submarine? Really? A for speed, B for sonic ping, and Z for torpedoes. Yeah, I think this transformation is pretty cool. Oh, don't go back in the pool. <laughs> Really had to do that. <laughs> That's sad. Yes, I know. I keep pressing B to swim faster. But instead, I keep having to hear you talk. 
talk the same old talk and dialogue. Alright, we're gonna turn our submarine, and you get a good look at it. And we're off. Let's go fight that stinking boss. I can find my way out of here. Yeah, the torpedo attack is pretty sweet. So it's noted that up here... I don't know. It's pretty much the lowest spot. There's a... that's the one by area. Okay. I think we need to head over to the boss. And that would be easy... easily... easily... easiest... Uh, teleported. And you can't go to the town center. Which was kind of expected, I suppose. Alright, is this Davy Jones Laka? No. W. Brian? Could care less about W. Brian. Oh, here it is. Oh, you jerk. I don't care. I'm gonna go in this boss room as is. You aren't gonna stop me, fish. Of course the gate closes. Hey, Banjo, I can see a Jiggy down there. Let's take a look. Lord Wu Fock Fock. Who oh, dares to draw Lord Wu Fack Fack? None of, no matter how you say it, it sounds... ...wrong. Don't lie to me, you were just going to steal my jiggy and drain me home, leading me exactly around the bottom until I'd sure and died. Something like that. The watery grave awaits you. Not as a... ...submarine, it isn't. So, as a submarine, unlimited ammo is the benefit here. shoot away. Normally you'd uh, come in here with grenade eggs, if you're the Baron Bird, but I feel the submarine is more appropriate to fight this guy. So you can just friggin' shoot away and you don't have to do anything. You don't have to go down in the corner and get eggs and quite like it. So, I'm gonna try and take this guy out quick. He can't see anything, so it's not like he can accurately aim at something. Really? Did you just push me? Although I didn't take any damage, but... Get him. Alright. Wow, surprisingly accurate here. I wouldn't have expected this. Oh, get him. Nah. Wasn't a chance there. I had to, I had to be a little more to the side. Whoa! Very close up. Oh, don't keep doing that. It's not something we should be doing. I don't need those. I guess maybe I do, but not for this boss battle. Oh, yeah, it's two more friggin' hits. Go get him. I guess I was looking for health. Up, up. Oh, wow. Didn't look like it hit him anywhere at all. Yeah. I just love spamming. Yes, there we go. Oh, he opened his eyes. You know sympathy? Hitting a poor blind fish? Time I open my eyes to see what I'm doing. Yeah, well, that just made you more vulnerable. Oh, right in the eyes. Urn, please, not my eyes. Boss is not really that hard. Kind of gets tedious if you just keep going in circles with this guy, but you can just get him in the eyes. It's pretty simple. You can't trap a submarine in a bubble. 
didn't even teach you physics? Oh, but he can't hear me with lasers. No, you, it's not possible. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Yes. I'm quite pleased with how this boss battle is going. It's like I'm looking for health or something. I just need to go up there and get him. I have enough health to survive. Get him! Yes. Ha! Went a lot quicker. Oh, no! You just... Flippy flopped upside down. Curses! Things seem to have gone belly up. A hundred years of oceanic tyranny brought to an end. Ah, uh, certain words. Certain words. Mr. Lord Wu. And a jiggy force. I believe you can talk to this guy and see what he, he has to say. Oh yes, this happens all the time. In fact, I quite like being upside down. Hello? Hello? Oh. Cease firing. He used to be a hero. Didn't you know? Oh wait. Stop that, you scumbags. I know your father. What does that mean? What does that even mean? Is this Star Fox? Okay, I think we're uh, I think we're done talking with you, and that's gonna be it for this part of the playthrough. Join me in part 18.